All right, so the common statistic being told lately is that the A's AAA team, the Las Vegas Aviators, draws more fans than the A's. And that is actually true for a couple of games, right? The Aviators played certain games on certain nights where they had more fans at the stadium than the A's. But actually, looking at the math, the A's are still averaging more fans per game, um, about 1,200 more fans per game uh, than the Aviators. And so... I feel like the common misconception is that the aviators have higher attendance, but that's not the point of what I'm trying to make here. People are trying to use the Las Vegas aviators as justification for the A's to move to Las Vegas. And, you know, I see it as, you know, if I'm playing devil's advocate, yeah, maybe it's, it's a valid reason to have a pro baseball team in Las Vegas or just more pro sports in Las Vegas. But I mean, it is a completely ridiculous reason to have, you know, to say, oh, the A's should move to Las Vegas because their minor league team draws more. Minor league baseball and major league baseball is a completely different subject. It's apples and oranges, right? Ba you know, the A's fans that show up to A's games, you know, the, the 8,000 of them per game is, you know, are the diehard fans, right? You know, you, you don't really have many like the, of the casual fans going to A's games that much. It, that's really more for the Giants because the A's fans, you know, that show up night in and night out are the diehards that are there to support their team. The people going to Aviators games, you know, I, I, you know, there probably are diehard minor league baseball fans out there, but minor league baseball is different. It's not, you know, a thing where you're rallying your team to win the World Series. It's the kind of thing where you go, and I, you know, I know that's true because that's how it is here in California, and it's the same way in Vegas because, you know, people in Vegas, you know, they they show up to the games when the team is good. The Aviators are a good team, and you know, they're a minor league team, so there's less you know, pressure put on it. Also, you know, sort of on a side note, people try to compare the Las Vegas Golden Knights attendance to the A's attendance. And I'm, that is even more ridiculous. First of all, it's a different sport. And the, you know, hockey arenas are much smaller than baseball stadiums. Also, the Vegas Golden Knights, except for this year, have been a extremely competitive, good team. The A's you know, as we know, are not extremely competitive every year. What's going to happen if the A's move to Las Vegas and they suck? Nothing. Um, and it's funny that, you know, this is all talked about in the midst of the A's dodging a big hurdle in the Howard Terminal Stadium plan. I mean, you know, this is ridiculous even bringing this up, comparing minor league baseball attendance with major league when the A's even, you know, have more fans per game at, than the, you know, the Aviators. It's just people don't do the math. I mean, it, the Aviators have had 122,000 fans at 18 games, you divide, you know, that it's 6,800. Uh, the A's average 8,000 per game. It, it's just, it's stupid. But back to the Vegas Golden Knights. They play in an extremely competitive environment and they've been good almost all of their existence. And also they're an expansion team. They don't have a reputation. The A's have a horrible reputation of horrible ownership. And so what's going to happen when there's 162 games of, you know, complete depressing, you know, A's baseball in the desert in 81 home games. It's just comparing that is stupid. I get it's funny. It's funny. I, you know, it's a, it's a, it's a good laugh, right? The A's have less fans, per, you know, at a game than the Aviators for like two games. Who cares? It's funny. It's funny, right? It's funny. But is it a justification for the A's moving to Las Vegas? Absolutely not. You know, the, there's no valid justification for the A's moving to Las Vegas. Does La, should Las Vegas get an MLB team? Maybe. I don't know. Sure. I don't care. As long as it's not the A's, I don't care. I mean, sure, they, you know, they're they're an up and coming city with sports. Um, the Raiders are 26 in attendance there. I, you know, people tend to brush that under the rug because you know the Knights have good attendance, but and the Aviators do. But comparing minor league baseball, you know, attendance records with major league baseball attendance records is completely ridiculous. Oakland and Vegas are completely different markets, and I'm not just talking about like the quality of the cities or how different the cities are. It's like Vegas is a tourist town. Oakland is like where the diehard fans show up. I can guarantee you the Aviators fans showing up to their games do not follow the Aviators like the A's fans follow the A's. The A's have a diehard fan base, um, albeit, you know, the attendance is embarrassing, I'll, I'll admit. You know, I think the A's attendance is a huge problem. It doesn't look good for the team or the league. But the Aviators are a minor league team that play in a spring training level stadium. You know, it's a nice stadium, but it's small. And the fact that, you know, people are, you know, comparing their attendance, like they might average better percentage of fans going to games than the A's. Um, but, you know, you put the A's in Las Vegas, <clears throat> they're going to play there in that weather. They're not going to get the support, especially because they're not going to be competitive. And the A's in general, 
they attract a certain diehard breed of fans. People aren't going to make the trip out to Vegas. And I, I feel like it's been said so many times. I feel like I'm repeating information. It's just the A's in Las Vegas wouldn't work at all. I don't know why it's such a hyped up idea when Howard Terminal is very close, very close to being built at this point. I know people deny it is because they're against it, but you know, comparing minor league sports, hockey, and even football with major league baseball is completely and utterly, you know, stupid. I think it's just, it's quite frankly, a dumb argument. Um, and I think it's, it's stupid when the aviators, you know, people don't, didn't do the math, but they actually don't average more fans than the A's. They don't, they had a couple of games where they had more fans there than the A's. So it's pointless. It's pointless. It's, it's a good laugh. It's funny. You know, to say, oh, a minor league team averages more than a major league team. It's it's really funny. You know, it's a good laugh. I get a kick out of it. But at the end of the day, I, what do I do with that information, right? It's just, it's stupid. And the A's will not succeed in Las Vegas. Um, Oakland, it's like they will have fans show up at Howard Terminal. And they'll attract the casual fan. That's what it's all about these days. You don't need diehard showing up, uh, you know, all the time. You want the casual fans that will, you know, be attracted to your stadium. That's how sports is nowadays. It's sad, but that's the reality. So anyways, guys, that's it. A um, little bit of an explanation. Let me know your thoughts. I'll see you guys later. And yeah, go A's.